Okay, my people. So, where do I start, eh? Where do I start? I'm gonna get straight into the video. So, this is the introduction to my prep series. Um, I'm cutting down, shredding, trying to get lean for the summer. A run through of uh, what happened in those four weeks. So, you're probably wondering if you're doing a series, why didn't you record the video the first week? The reason being is because I feel ill. Yeah, I felt a bit ill. I had uh, the runs a bit. There were certain foods that I was having that I had to tweak, change around. Hence why I didn't want to record. And honestly, those week or two, I was not in the mood to do anything. Obviously, dropping calories takes a, it takes your body a while to adapt to the energy stores on there. But right now, it's been about like three weeks, three and a half weeks, and I could honestly say that. I feel like I feel normal now. My body has adapted. So the first week, um, I'm having about six meals, including a protein shake. Um, no, seven meals, which is the seventh meal, which is like a post workout shake. Um, my breakfast meal, like the first week, was egg whites. Uh, you know the carton ones that you get from like the supermarket. The supermarkets, two chick. The brand was. Um, I was literally pouring that in and obviously adding my own spices and herbs, um, vegetables, but it wasn't sitting well on my stomach, so I've changed that. Um, and then all of these changes that are being made is uh, I'm getting coached by my uncle, so he's helping me along the way, giving me advice and tips. And then, so yeah, that egg meal was eliminated, and I replaced that with um, chicken mince and um, Chicken mince. Yeah, chicken mince and a bit of rice. I'm not going to tell you guys meal, meal by meal what I'm having because I want to keep this video, this introduction video quite short. I'm going to go training a bit so I'll, I'll film that training session for you guys. But in terms of my diet, it stayed the same. So my oats, I've got my oats right now uh, for the first meal. Then a couple of chicken mince meals with potatoes, tuna, post workout shake and a yogurt and protein powder. But like I said, I'll do meal by meal in my next video so that'll be episode two this is episode one i'll do episode two in the next couple of days so in terms of training training's been there like the first week or two my energy stores weren't there uh training was hard but funny enough my strength as a go i'm actually getting stronger believe it or not but right now the next four weeks i did it today's check-in day i sent my way over to my uncle and um he said to me the next four weeks is going to be crazy hard so um, I did no cardio for the first three, uh, first two weeks. Third week I did implement, we did implement two cardio sessions. And um, when do I do cardio? Sometimes fasted, but week three, those two cardio sessions I did after the end of my workout, my weight session. But um, week four, which is just gone now, I do, I've done, I don't know, four cardio sessions. And I'm doing the Stairmaster. I'm training abs every couple of days. Uh, top of that, sometimes it's fasted in the mornings, or sometimes it's like the end of the workout. Uh, the first week I dropped about 0.6 pounds. Second week, I believe it was around a kg I lost. Week three, I did not lose anything. Week four, which is check-in day today, and I sent my way over to my uncle. Um, I'm 74.6, so I dropped a kg within the last week. But he had said to me, now the next four weeks is going to be crazy, crazy hard. You're going to have to really, really push yourself. Carbs are going to be dropped um, more. Week three, when I didn't drop any weight, um, so from week two to week three, my weight stayed the same. So he said, uh, my uncle said, week three, you're going to drop your carbs. So I had to eliminate one of my carb meals so it was, it was a tuna and potato so I had to eliminate the potato meal out and I did four cardio sessions and I dropped a kg this week but now you said the next four weeks is going to be you're going to really have to dig deep so I'm gonna there's going to be dropping carbs my new plan will be sent to me later on uh, for tomorrow to start the stuff to start week five uh, so drop the uh, carbs are going to be dropped um, cardio session I believe is going to stay the same four weeks, uh, four weeks, four days a week. 
and um, I'm training up every couple of days like I just mentioned so that was the reason why also I didn't want to record because I just wanted my body to adapt, get used to the diet um, but now I've got four weeks I'm not going to do a video a week I'm going to try to get two or three videos out per week I'm going to try so I'm recording today I might record tomorrow or the day after to show you guys meal by meal what I'm actually having so obviously it's changed a bit but not too much uh, in terms of like week one, week one and two it was the same 2600 is calories uh, week three and week four which is just gone I was on about 2500 ish but uh, obviously my new plan will be sent to me tomorrow and that's what I'm going to be sticking to for the next four weeks I believe so in terms of progress pictures, I've been taking no progress pictures, but my uncle has told me to make sure you start taking progress pictures. Um, I am getting leaner, I'm actually getting a bit bigger, but that's the illusion when you cut down, you look a bit bigger. My veins are starting to pop up more, abs are starting to be more visible, um, so it is working. But um, my whole cut is eight weeks, so I believe if I did another couple of weeks, I just, I, I'm not in my end product yet, so I don't know how I look, but I look decent enough, but I just know that if I could do extra couple of more weeks, I would look peeled. Um, no, I'm not competing. I was going to, but I'm actually flying out to Pakistan to see family. We go every three years as a family, so um, I'm going at the day after Eid. So I just wanted to get, it's summer around the corner, it's when summer in industry is here, and it? so I did want to start my cut. But I believe I should have signed my cut during Ramadan, but it is what it is. Um, but yeah, man. Other than that, I think I mentioned everything. I'm about to have meal number one, and then I'm gonna shoot to the gym and train, push, and then I might do cardio legs at a pure gym. But in terms of everything, I think I covered everything. Uh, yeah, man. Yeah. Cramp, ah, cramp on my calf. <laughs> ah, cramp on my calf. Ah, ooh, ooh. I'm okay. I just want to say as well, this has been a life service so far. Like, I've never been a fan of like protein shakes or like to, to taste. But this is 100% up there. So, it's USM Blue Lab, 100% whey, strawberry flavour, absolutely bang on, bang on, I tell ya. People, this should just come back from the gym elite. Uh, did chest and triceps. I came back and brought off a back to field. Basically, I'll show you one of my meals. But anyway, I'll show you that in my next video in the next couple of days, meal by meal, what I'm gonna have. Um, but I had chicken mint, white rice, and a bit of salad. And now I let that digest for a bit. Ch ch uh, chilled, chilled for a little bit. Uh, done a couple of editing. Uh, for some Instagram videos and then now I'm literally about to shoot up to Pure Gym and do 20 minute cardio on the Stairmaster and I might do a bit of abs as well so yeah let's go now
All right, so people, so I went and done cardio, finished up cardio, then I went straight to where we're going to have my last cheat meal. And uh, I'm going to put the videos on the screen now. That's episode one complete. Oh, that's so <laughs> Bro. <laughs> I'm wearing a blanket. I've got shorts on. Shut up. That one there was a violation, personally, I wouldn't. And uh, yeah, if you like this video, be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. And um, I will catch you guys very, very soon. So yeah, peace out, my people. My people! You want to say anything, big man? Bomb crack. No. Oh my <sighs> So, as I was saying, what you do? <laughs> you go as you wouldn't stand. Yeah.